Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Leo for the month of October. It is a general reading, so it will not resonate with each and every one of you who are watching. If this does not sound like your story, check your moon sign or your rising sign. Your messages could be there. And if not, simply check back in the following week when I put out a new message for your sign. Okay, so, um, so let me see here. Okay, so um, the tree, it's about, a, it can be about wisdom in a connection. Um, it can be about uh, new growth or the stages of growth, something um, evolving, growing, um, transforming over a long period of time. Um, it can indicate um, wisdom needed uh, in order to make something grow. So um, beneath it is the card of trickery. And beneath that is the apple, which again is speaking to wisdom, but it can also speak to temptation in love. I feel that maybe you were tempted by something or that you will be um, to make something grow, but there appears to be suspicions. Um, it's like... Uh, you don't have all of the information because uh, it can be like um, the missing piece. Yeah. Okay, so moving to uh, the center of this reading we then have the wings the lantern and the six of shields so um the wings are about um wishes messages and we have a message card here um it can be that you are wishing for someone to come to you or to go to them you may be wishing to set yourself free from something um, or and, and it could be anything burdens it could be um, uh, fears anything okay now the lantern um, is instinct um, that gut feeling uh, trusting in it uh, following up on it um, it can also be reflection, retreat, seeking answers. So I feel that you are either wishing for news or are going to be seeking um, uh, this person or reaching out to them. So you could be the sender of the message. You could be seeking this clarity. Whatever this was, it ended badly in the past. And maybe you... Wait, I'll come back to that thought. <laughs> so it ended badly in the past we see it here this card is negative upright or reverse doesn't matter which position it's in okay this is uh, a battle that took place and you can see the sword was placed in the stone and somebody is stubbornly sitting in that energy you were them um, being silent not talking so they're not talking there's probably been no communication but they want to, you see, it's making sense here now. They want to, they're thinking of reaching out. So this is either your energy or it is the other person's energy. 
but the rabbit sits back waiting, maybe waiting on this message. But desires um, to reach out to someone, desires to hear from them. This person looks very stubborn, stubbornly sitting in this energy of a decision, perhaps, that was taken with the, the sword in the stone. So there was an error that was made here. Um, An error that was made, possibly um, somebody tried to cover up the error. Um, but then uh, possibly they ran. And there was deception here somewhere. Whatever happened here... Uh, caused the flame to go out. It caused the ending or the transformation of this relationship. So here we have um, the story. Um, and so this is about your story. Um, it is about the story of others. It is about listening. Um, you could be trying to figure out uh, your story. You can be trying to figure out how to write it. Or maybe you need to do this. What is your story? How do you envision your story playing out from here? What changes will you make or do you need to make? Who's writing your story and who shall be the hero of your story? You may have thought that someone else was giving you a story in a relationship about wanting to Move it up. I feel like you uh, are, you or they are tempted to reach out. We keep getting that message to make things better, to help the situation so that there can be a new beginning but there's fear here surrounding this leap of faith so now we have um, the skull with the Four of Love and the Queen of Cups. And the Queen of Cups, she's reaching for that cup, you see. Reaching for it. This is what you want. This is what you are thinking of. This is what you're unhappy about, you or them. Okay, whoever's energy this is. Maybe not being happy with your options. Maybe not stepping up. Maybe there's something they need to face. Um, or something that they're afraid of or not trusting. And so it's like they're not happy with their options. They're not happy about this, um, the way things transformed, about the ending
somebody here is a very um, bitter may have given the cold shoulder it may have taken or they may have been very decisive mm, taking a this decision uh, strength it took all of their strength to do this they were not happy with the hand they were dealt uh, you or them and so um, let's say it was them um, so they brought in the tower on this relationship they were not happy with the hand or they are not happy now with their hand um, somebody moved away thinking uh, it was the right thing to do. Here's that same queen again reappearing. The dark. Living in the dark. Unwelcome surprises. Deception. Somebody somebody's in the dark and they're in a very dark place. We see it here. We see it here, not happy with the hand. And this lady is stuck in Okay, so not having all of her information, she feels trapped here in this, it's like a mental prison in the dark, needing this information. Um, looking, studying the direction um, with the hermit here. There's a decision they don't want to take, so they release the swords and cover the eyes, listening to that intuition, the gut feeling, again, coming into play here. Yeah. Okay. Watching with the eye. needing to see clearly um, and then we have this reunion and the five of wands let's try and put this all together because the five of wands okay the eye is watching um, seeking cooperation wait I'm seeing a card in my mind's eye did I see it here No, but they're showing me that card. Okay. So, um, you may, you or they are watching because it's what you're wanting is the other person. But an error was made somewhere. Maybe somebody misjudged something or maybe somebody did something um possibly that they may feel they would not be forgiven for testing this is about testing someone this card oh one minute sorry about that so i feel like um Clearly, an error was made and, and was there was an attempt to uh, cover it up. I don't know who did that, if it was you or the other person. Um, but I feel like I feel like they knew that 
that they would they'd be in trouble for it and they so they kind of ran it brought it, it blew out the flame here it, it was um what brought in this tower you were them now somebody doesn't like the hand they were dealt with regards to this relationship but still desire the relationship and maybe they cut out the relationship but didn't want to but felt that they had to because of the error that was made here what we see what we see is that um they still desire the coin they desire news or they will themselves be sending news uh within a three wanting to move this from uh this uh very choppy water that it's in to a calmer place and there's hope here there's that they've got that just that glimmer this card speaks to a glimmer of hope a light in the darkness and here is the dark maybe waiting for the right moment to do this testing the waters justice hmm cause and effect truth consequences taking responsibility someone may have to do that um it is about um a fair decision a fair judgment doing what is right taking the right decision so when this card appears justice will be served here it is you can see it where it was but here it is so um justice will be served um but who is serving up the justice and what type um will it be if on the receiving end we get what we deserve as determined by those sitting in judgment over this we have no control except to make sure that we have all of our facts in order you know and that they're clearly understood by everyone if we are sitting in judgment which face of justice do we wish to embody will we forgive as we would wish to be forgiven or shall we demand our pound of flesh and it's funny because i saw here this card which uh, also speaks to forgiveness being in question so you may be required to forgive someone or they may uh, be the ones required or um, or questioning whether they can forgive you That is what I have for you. I thank you for watching, for liking, and for sharing my videos, and for subscribing. I apologize for the telephone ringing. I forgot to shut it off. And um, uh, also, I would like to um, say thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings.